guys, it's me, Jen, and I wanted to make a little video for you to talk about the brand new mod that has come out from, uh, he used to be known as Dramatic Gamer, and he just recently changed his name to Sacrificial. Uh, he makes amazing mods, and I'm going to talk to you guys about this new one called um, the Road to Fame mod, where you can be a celebrity. It works very similarly to Sims 3 celebrity system, but not exactly. But there's a lot of similar aspects with paparazzi following you and on and on. So uh, what I'm going to tell you guys is this. Everything in the video is going to be timestamped. So if you want to find us, if you're just looking for a certain aspect, look in the comments or not in the comments, I'm sorry, look in the bottom bar and you should find the, exactly what you're looking for. I'm gonna go through everything you need to know about getting this mod in your game. I'm also going to have a link to this mod and anything else that you need in the bottom bar. So just know that and let's begin. So all you need to do is go to the page right here and right here there is gonna be a direct download link. If you look at it right here, you just click on it. What's gonna happen is it's gonna open up into this kind of a page right here. And then it's gonna automatically download into your computer. Now, once you get to this section, you get to pick where this download goes. So if you just click save, it's gonna go into your downloads folder. That may be a bit of a mess because you probably have a bajillion downloads. So what I like to do is have a separate folder on my desktop that is specifically just for mods that I download so I know exactly where to find them. So I have this folder right here, it's called TSR, and that's where I put all my Sims mods. In. So you just wanna click on that, and then once you have that selected, you click Save. That is how you get your mod downloaded. It is that simple, just like two easy steps. Now that we have it downloaded onto our computer, we're going to extract it and put it in our game. So we're gonna locate the folder where we have it saved on our desktop, or you're gonna to go to your downloads folder. If you didn't select a folder to temporarily save it to, it'll be in your downloads folder. But I have a folder right here, so you're just gonna open up that folder. And here it is right here, the road to fame. This is what it looks like. This is a zipped file, which means that everything you need is inside of this, but in order to get this into your game, you need to extract it first. So in order to extract everything from this folder, you're gonna need a program called WinRAR. I made a video all about it. I'm gonna link it in the cards right now. I'm also gonna have a link to that video in the bottom bar if you want uh, to look at it that way. There are two different types of, of softwares to extract files that I know of, WinRAR and Rozilla. I personally use Rozilla, but the video that I made will show you how to find it and how to download it. So once you have that downloaded and you have that installed into your computer, you'll be able to open this zipped file. So what we wanna do is we wanna go to this zip file, we wanna highlight it, then we're going to right click and then we're gonna select open. This is what you're gonna find when you open that. You're gonna see this thing that's in a little folder and this thing that is like a how to install. You don't have to put in the how to install into your mods folder because that's just instructions. But this little piece right here, this little, this little folder, you wanna click on that. Then you wanna right click. You wanna select cut. Now please guys listen to me, this is so important. You have to cut and paste. You cannot copy and paste. You cannot drag it. You have to cut and paste. I get so many comments from people about mods saying that they don't work and it's because they did not cut and paste. I don't know why it's that way. It just is. So just deal with it. <laughs> so we're gonna cut and then we're gonna go into our mods folder. To find our mods folder, we're gonna go to this PC. Then we're gonna go to documents. Then we are going to go to Electronic Arts. Then we're gonna to go to The Sims 4. Then we're gonna to go to Mods right here. Now, if you don't have a Mods folder for some reason, some people don't, all you need to do is find an empty spot somewhere over here, right click, select New, select Folder, 
and then once you have that folder you want to just name it mods and it'll work fine but you most likely have a mods folder so you want to go here you want to click on that then you want to right click and then you want to select open now I have a couple of mods in my game already so what you want to do is you want to find an empty spot you want to right click and then you want to click paste you're going to give that time to enter into your game and now you'll see it is listed amongst all my other mods so now we're going to boot up our sims game and i'm going to show you guys how this works okay you guys i just started out my game and if you notice you're going to get if you have done this right you're going to notice this square that says mods that shows up this is going to show you all the mods that you have in your game you have to select this little blue check mark that's in the bottom right hand corner so when you go over it it's going to turn green there you go if for some reason that blue square did not show up or if you're having any other issues what you might want to do is go to these three little dots over here and then you want to go into game options and then you want to go all the way down here to other and you want to make sure that you enable script mods so that's really really important in order for this to run so if you're having any issues just make sure you you do that step okay you guys this has been the video on how to install this mod into your game if you guys have any questions or concerns comment below and I will do my very best to answer them for you and help you guys out look out for another video I'll be uploading all about the whole overview of this mod how to use it my review uh the ins and outs that's going to be a totally different video this video is just about getting it in your game so you can start having fun if you like this video and you enjoy these types of videos which i have many on my channel by the way give me a thumbs up and you might want to subscribe if you have a mod out there that you do not know how to get in your game or you do not know how to use all you need to do is comment below and i will make a tutorial for you guys because I love helping you guys play your sims and enjoy your sims games more. It gives me a big thrill. So uh, that's it. I will talk to you guys in my next video. I hope you have a wonderful day. Take care. Love you guys.